In this video, I'm going to show you how to make a pivot table. Pivot tables are extremely powerful, extremely useful, and extremely easy. With just a few clicks, we can get summary data by using a pivot table. What I'm going to do is I'm going to click on insert and then pivot table. It's going to highlight all of the data and then ask me to click OK. It's going to automatically select the entire range. So the pivot table brings over headers. To create the pivot table, we have to select any of this data and then pull it down into the quadrant down here for filters, columns, rows, and values. What I'm going to do is I'm going to click on vendor name and then I'm going to click on payable amount. So what Excel did was it's brought over all of the vendor names and it's going to consolidate so where Relics Theater was in there multiple times it's going to pull in just one Relics Theater. So here's All Occasions Catering and then All Occasions Party Rentals. You can see it's consolidated all of the spend that we've had with them into just one row of data. This is a sum of all of the amount that was entered in IRIS for the 85 contract for any of the 85 contracts with All Occasions Catering. If I wanted to see how many contracts there were with these vendors instead of the amount that we've paid, I'm going to click on Sum here, click on Field Value, and then Count. So there were five contracts with All Occasions Catering. So that's it. Pivot tables are extremely easy to use. They're extremely useful. And this right here will save you a ton of time when it comes to building reports. I hope that you found this video helpful. Please let me know if you have questions.